If you come to Japan, you'll actually find that people still use uh, rock, paper, scissors to make a lot of decisions. Uh, that's great if you have a very simple decision, if like you want to decide who does something. Uh, but to be honest, if I have a single decision that I want to make that has multiple options, rock, paper, scissors doesn't work very well. I was in a Japanese sushi bar and a drunk businessman actually showed me how, sort of in a traditional way, Japanese people make this decision, again, using sort of a kid's game. Uh, my friends Antoinette and Marlo were trying to figure out this game when they saw some students do it on the whiteboard. So I figured I would give a quick explanation. Now my decision that I want has three options. So you can see I've made three lines that go all the way to the bottom of the page. And at the bottom I've actually written the three options and uh, folded the paper over. And between each line I've added these sort of bridges. Now if I want to completely randomize this, I could just get someone else to come in and stick a couple more bridges on. Uh, this is going to make it hard. For, I'm holding the camera so these aren't very clean. But, and one more. Okay? <clears throat> now, even though I made this, it's actually very difficult for me to tell where I would end up choosing option one, two, three at the top. So what you do is you choose one. I'm going to choose three. And basically I just follow the path. I go down, I've hit this bridge, I go across. I go down, I've hit this bridge, I go across. I go down, I hit this bridge, I go across, down, back, and down. And it takes me down to option three. Uh, let's just see, if I chose an option two, I would have ended up at oh, option one. And if I chose number one, I would have ended up at Dun, 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 number two. So you can tell even though I made this, it's very difficult for me to guess where it would end up. So let's see the decision I was trying to make was number one was I want to have sex with Marlo. Number two was I want to have sex with Marlo in the butt. And number three, the decision I've ended up with is I want to have sex with Marlo in the butt on it. So next time you have a difficult decision, feel free to try to use this system to help you make up your mind.